welcome back to my channel. Um, so today's video is just going to be a quick AliExpress haul. These are just some stamps and some dies that I received over the last week while I was out of town. Um, so to start off, I got this little bag of topper die. It measures out in three inches. Oop. Here we go. Three inches by two and a quarter inches. And uh, just makes cute, simple little ba um, bag toppers. Um, unfortunately, I haven't really had time to make anything with all of the pieces that I received since I just got home. But I wanted to make sure that I shared these with you guys. Um, back. All right. So the other one I received was this. Um, snowflake border die from uh, Elena Cuddle. I'm sure many, many people have already seen this. It has been hauled numerous times. Um, it measures out in five and a half inches in length, so it's perfect to go across the front of an A2 card. Um, this I did try to cut out. Um, I need, I really need to get a a metal shim, something that is going to help me get these more intricate pieces because I just, I have serious, serious issues. And I've tried many things, but now that I'm back. All right, guys. So I guess a transformer just blew on my street. Um, if you don't already know, I live in the Pacific Northwest, um, just outside of Seattle, like literally in the suburbs of Seattle. And um, we had a huge windstorm this weekend. Actually, as I was flying back in to SeaTac Airport, like the windstorm was picking up. And then um, by the time I landed and got through baggage claim and everything. Um, it had started raining really, really bad. And now, mind you, it takes me, oh, I don't know, 15, 16 minutes to get home from the airport. Like I said, I live like right in the suburbs of Seattle. So um, it was crazy for me to literally go from just a little bit of turbulence coming into the airport to it kind of just barely raining once we got into the Uber to get back home to literally being inside of my house for two minutes and then all of my power shutting off. Um, my power came back on yesterday at around 5, 5.30 p.m. And then, yeah, just now while I'm sitting here in the middle of trying to record this video... Bam, transformer blows, and I am now back out of power. So this is fantastic. <laughs> but uh, we will continue on. We're just going to not have as great of lighting as we had before. So um, like I was saying, this is the Elena Cuddle um, die that goes with... One second. This is like the coordinating die basically to this. So depending upon how you want to do it, you can have your cards like have one at the top, have one at the bottom. You could, you know, have two different kinds of cards and have like, boom, and have a set of like coordinating dies. So, I mean, there's a lot of options that you can do with this. This one is just snowflakes while um, this one right here has like little trees in it. So that's super duper cute. I really like that. Like I said, if you have a better machine than mine <laughs> and it cuts everything, like, I don't know how well it's going to focus. Let me try. Oh, of course, now I just turned on active track, so we're going to turn that off. So, yeah, um, then your design's going to turn out a lot better than yes. Um, I also got a set of heart-shaped nesting dies. They have a stitch border that goes along them. There's 10 here they measure from the smallest being a half an inch and the largest being like four and a quarter by four and three quarters. 
So they're a really good size there. And then I also got a bunch of really cute stamps. So the first set I got was these. Before activation, oops. Down Sorry about that. So the first set I got was um, these little like neighborhood, welcome to the neighborhood stamps. So there's like a little city, there's little houses, you got the stars up here with some hearts. It says, welcome. In my imaginary neighborhood, you live right next door to the neighborhood. Good friends are like stars. You don't always see them, but you know that they're always there. I miss you. We should hang out soon. So these are super duper cute. I love these. And then I picked up a bunch of Spanish dyes, or not dyes, stamps. Um, I do not speak fluent Spanish, but I speak well enough that um, I would like to have these things in my inventory when I do my craft fairs. Um, in the Seattle area, we have a large, large mix of cultures. And so I try very hard to make sure that like I immerse myself in a lot of different cultures. And so I want to also be able to supply things to people in many different cultures. Um, so these are some Christmas ones that just say Feliz Navidad. Uh, si fan del la Navidad, que emoción. Um, I'm not even sure what this one means, but Toronizate, I think is what that one is. I'm going to have to Google that. Here is like this cute little like boy soldier fantasy type thing. Um, so it says Siempre Contigo, which is always together. Un Mundo Magico, a magic world. Mi Pequeño Guerrero, my little war. Um, grandes fanti fantasias, you know, like grand fantasies. Oh, sorry. Soldadito Valiente is a valiant soldier, like little soldier. That's the Ito. Um, momento, yeah, momentos magicos. Um, you know, magical moments. So super cute there. Um, I love this one. This one is Wizard of Oz. Look at this. It's Dorothy and Toto. This um, Tin Man and the Scarecrow. Look at the Cowardly Lion. The Little Witch. And it says Oz. Mas allá de arco iris oh, somewhere over the rainbow. In algún lugar that's somewhere. Or some place to be exact. Lugares magicos, magical places. Ciudad Esmeralda is the Emerald City. So all kinds of cute little things on here. And then um, I got this, which is like kids, students type thing. Um, so mi pequeño gran estudiante, tu primer día de cole. Soñar despierto. Compartir. Tiendo sueños. So, you know, all kinds of different things about like my first day of school and getting a good night's sleep and fun stuff. And then the very last one I got is just really simple. It's like a little chef lady and it says mis recetas secretas. So, like my secret recipe. So, super duper cute. Really excited to start using all of these and building up my card stash. Um, but yeah, so that's everything that arrived while I was in Mexico. And until next time, please smash that like button, subscribe, tell your friends about me, and uh, have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye!